has a wonderful hallelujah. Everyone all over the world watching this program right now, wherever you may be, whether in America, in Europe, in Asia, in Africa, anywhere you are on the face of this earth, shout a Jericho destroying hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart. I will enter his court with praise. I will say, I will say, this is the day that the Lord has made. Oh yes, I will rejoice for he has made me glad. I will enter, I will enter his gates with thanksgiving in my heart. I will enter this court with praise. I will say, I will say, this is the day that the Lord has made. Oh yes, I will rejoice for he has made me glad. I will enter, I will enter this gate with thanksgiving in my heart. I will enter this court with praise. I will say, I will say, this is the day that the Lord has made. Oh yes, I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad. He has made me glad. I am so glad. I will rejoice for he has made me Oh! 
another wonderful hallelujah. hallelujah. Praise God. Matthew 21 and verse 22. Matthew 21 and verse 22. And all things whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer, believing ye shall receive. And whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer, believing, not doubting, believing ye shall receive. Ye shall receive. Psalm 91 and verse 15. Psalm 91 and verse 15 says, He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble, and I will deliver him and honor him. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble, and I will deliver him. I stand upon the rock of ages tonight, and I declare that every other ground is sinking sand. I stand upon the mountain of clam, I stand upon, the, I stand under the grace of my father, my mother and the Lord, Pastor and Mrs. Pastor Ole Ladiu, and Pastor Mrs. Bukola Ladiu, to make the following declarations unto you, and I want a resounding amen where you are all over the world. That tonight, everything we shall ask the Lord, the Lord will answer us. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will answer you. Amen. The Lord will answer me Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord will answer us. The Lord will answer us Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray tonight that every conspiracy against our prayers, that conspiracy shall scatter in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every conspiracy against our progress, every conspiracy against our destiny, let that conspiracy scatter by fire Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. I declare that every power using dreams to injure our progress, to injure our settlement in the land where we are. Let that power be arrested Amen. by fire in the name of Jesus. Let that power be arrested Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray that every standing order in the kingdom of darkness, any standing order against your rising up, against my rising up, every standing order against your family, against my family, against your ministry, against this ministry, Clam Prayer Academy Houston, and Clam Global, every standing order in the kingdom of darkness, let that order be cancelled. Let that order be cancelled. Let that order be cancelled. In the name of Jesus, let that order be cancelled. Let that order be cancelled. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that any unseen power, any invisible power stealing our prosperity from us in the dream, any power either in the dream or in the physical, any power from the kingdom of darkness stealing from us spiritually and physically, let that power be arrested, let that power be arrested and disgraced in the name of Jesus, let that power be arrested and disgraced in the name of Jesus. Whenever we want to make it big, when it is time for our settlement, any power saying no to our advancement, saying no to our settlement, let that power be arrested and disgraced in the name of Jesus. That power shall perish in the name of Jesus. Every Goliath of frustration assigned against our moving forward. Every Goliath and strong man of frustration assigned against our settlement in this land. Let that Goliath perish. Let that Goliath perish. Let that Goliath perish. Let that Goliath perish. In the name of Jesus, let that Goliath perish. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. if there's anything that has been captured from your life by witchcraft powers, let that be a recovery. Let there be a recovery in the name of Jesus. Let there be a recovery in the name of Jesus. Can I have a resounding amen? amen. In the name of Jesus, amen. I pray that every obstacle blocking our harvest, every obstacle blocking your settlement in this land, and in, or in the land where you are, all over the world, any obstacle blocking your settlement, let that obstacle be removed, let it 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 be removed, in the name of Jesus. So shall it be, in the name of God the Father, 
the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Father, in tonight's service, have your way in the name of Jesus. Do what you alone can do. Showcase your power. Do what you can do. Lord, showcase your power. Exhibit your power in the name of Jesus. Grant us testimonies. Answer our prayers, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. So shall it be, my God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Amen in Jesus' name. Settle. Shall we take our hymn before we sit down? Our hymn says, Standing on the Promises of God. That hymn is taken from 2 Corinthians chapter 1 and verse 20. 2 Corinthians chapter 1 and verse 20. For the promises of God in him are yea and amen to the glory of God through him. 2 Corinthians 1 and verse 20. Standing on the promises of God. Standing on the promises of God. La 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 Standing on the promises of God. Standing, standing on the promises, standing on the promises of God, my Savior. Standing on the promises, standing on the promises. I am standing on the promises of God. Standing on the promises that cannot fail. When the holy storms of doubt and fear are sealed By the living word of God I shall prevail Standing on the promises of God I'm standing, standing on the promises Standing on the promises Standing on the promises of God My Savior Standing on the promises Standing on the promises I am standing on the promises of God Standing on the promises I now can see Perfect presence cleansing in the book for me Standing on the liberty where Christ makes free Standing on the promises of God I'm standing, standing on the promises Standing on the promises Standing on the promises of God My Savior Standing on the promises Standing on the promises tonight to tonight's broadcast. It's a special night. Tonight we're dealing with this land will favor us. Possessing our possession. I declare to your life that you will possess your possession in the name of Jesus. This land, the land where you are in will favor you in the mighty name of Jesus. The land will favor you in the name of Jesus. The land will favor you. This land will favor you. Everyone put your right hand on your chest and say this land will favor me. This land will favor me. Whether the enemy likes it or not, this land will favor me. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, just some quick announcements. Wherever you are, please get a bottle of oil and a bottle of water. If uh, for adventure you're in the car, you're driving, if you have a bottle of water, it's okay. Uh, you can still get a bottle of oil later and uh, you know, pray on it or revisit this tape. We are live on Facebook and YouTube. 
live on both platforms. So if you're not on Facebook, please connect with us now on YouTube. Everyone, please hold your watch party. Press the, uh, the share button on your screen right now. Invite friends and family. I give you one minute to do that. Invite, share this all across, you know, all across board. Praise God. Praise the Lord. So a bottle of oil, a bottle of water, we're going to use it to anoint our heads, anoint our hands, anoint our feet at the end of this service. Don't worry, I'll tell you exactly what to do. You will just follow my lead. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. It is well with us all in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name, settled. Psalm 24, verses 1 to 10. Psalm 24, verses 1 to 10. The earth is the Lord, and the fullness thereof, the world and they that dwell therein. For he hath founded it upon the seas, and established it upon the floods. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord, or who shall stand in his holy place? He that hath clean hands and a pure heart, who hath not lifted up his soul unto vanity, nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive the blessing from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. This is the generation of them that seek him, that seek thy face, O Jacob. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be lifted up ye everlasting doors, that the King of glory will come into this tabernacle, come into your tabernacle where you are, to glorify himself, to behave as God, to showcase his power, in the name of Jesus, let the Lord come into your tabernacle. Lift up your heads, O ye gates. Be lifted up, ye everlasting doors. Let the King of glory come into this tabernacle. Come into your tabernacle where you are. To, to set the captives free. To behave as God. To give you what belongs to you. In the name of Jesus, who is this King of glory, the Lord mighty and strong, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your heads, O ye gates. Be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors, that the King of glory will come into this tabernacle, come into your tabernacle, to destroy every work of darkness, to destroy every work of the enemy, every concluded work of darkness. Let the Lord destroy it in the name of Jesus. Let the Lord break every chain, tying you down to where you don't belong in the name of Jesus. Let the Lord heal you where you need healing. In the name of Jesus, say, who is this King of glory? The Lord of hosts. He is the King of glory. The Lord of hosts. He is the King of glory. Let the Lord open our heavens tonight. In the name of Jesus, our heavens are hereby open. Let there be angelic traffic where you are. There shall be angelic traffic. Angels will descend and ascend upon you. In the name of Jesus, angels will descend to take up, take up your prayers and descend, take up your prayers, and come back again and give you answers. In the name of Jesus. The word of God will come unto you expressly where you are now. In the name of Jesus, and you begin to see visions of God. In the mighty name of Jesus. According to Ezekiel chapter 1, 1 to 3. Let the Lord visit you. Let the heavens be open. Heaven of answer prayers is open tonight. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. There is someone here that's what you're watching right now. You are in urgent need of help. Urgent need of help. As a matter of fact, if the Lord does not appear in the next 48 hours, that's it. It's over. The Lord said, I should tell you, give you this prophecy, and anyone that will say a big amen and bank this prophecy, we call it banking prophecies or banking prayers. If the prophecy is not for you, you claim it, you bank it. Second Samuel, 1 Samuel chapter 11, 1 Samuel chapter 11 and verse 9. And they said unto the messengers that came, Thus shall ye say unto the men of Jabesh Gilead, Tomorrow by that time the sun is hot, the sun is hot, ye shall have help. And the messengers came and showed it to the men of Jabesh, and they were glad. I declare to the life of you that person that will say a big amen. By the mouth of the Almighty God, by the word of God, by this time tomorrow, you will have help. 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 In the name of Jesus. By this time tomorrow, you will have help. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The Lord is set to do what's good tonight. Beloved, just say, we're going to do mostly uh, declarations tonight. I want your faith to rise. And I want you to shout for every proclamation. You shout a big amen where you are. Beloved, when a prayer goes forth, the only thing that connects you to that prayer is a believing amen. So in the realm of the spirit, if your amen is low, it means your level of connectivity is low. 
please don't let your amen be reduced. Don't let it go down. Say a believing and confident amen wherever you are tonight. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. Hebrews 4.12 says, Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12, For the word of the Lord is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit and the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of the thoughts and the intents of the heart. The word of God is quick and powerful. So as the word comes tonight, the word, that word of God will go forth and set you free and destroy every blo anything blocking your advancement, anything blocking your settlement. The word of God will sort it out in the name of Jesus. The word of God will sort it out in the name of Jesus. John chapter 1 verse 1 says, In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. In the beginning was the word, the word was with God, and the word was God. You're going to use your own mouth, because life and death are in the power of the tongue. You're going to use your own mouth today to declare some things, to declare some things to the heavens and to the earth, because death and life are in the power of the tongue. Job chapter 8 verse 2 says, How long will thou speak these things? And how long shall the words of their mouth be like a strong wind? The word of your mouth will not be a wind. In the name of Jesus, it will not be just an empty wind. In the name of Jesus. Numbers 14 and verse 28. Numbers 14 and verse 28. Say unto them, as truly as I live, said the Lord, as you have spoken in my ears, so will I do to you. So you're going to say some things into the ears of the Almighty God today, and he will do them to you in the name of Jesus. He will do them to us in the name of Jesus. Joel chapter 2 and verse 21. Joel chapter 2 and verse 21. Fear not, O land, be glad and rejoice, for the Lord will do great things. Fear not, O land, and rejoice, for the Lord will do great things. The Lord will do great things. The Lord will do great things. Leviticus 28 and verse 4. Leviticus 20, 26 and verse 4. I beg your pardon. Then I will give you rain in this season, and the land shall yield an increase, and the trees of the field shall yield their fruit. Then I will give you rain in this season. The Lord will give you rain in this season, in the name of Jesus. The land will yield an increase unto you, in the name of Jesus. The trees of the field shall yield their fruit, in the name of Jesus. Psalm 85 and verse 12. Psalm 85 and verse 12 says, Yea, the Lord shall give that which is good and our land shall yield an increase. Say to yourself, my land shall yield an increase. In the name of Jesus, my land shall yield an increase. In the name of Jesus. Leviticus 25 and verse 19. And the land shall yield our fruit, and ye shall eat your fill, and dwell therein in safety. Leviticus 25 and verse 19. And the land shall yield our fruit, and ye shall eat, you and your family members, you will eat, and, and it, it's your field. You will eat to the full and dwell therein in safety. None will make you afraid. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say a big amen where you are. Say a bigger amen. Philippians 2, 9 to 11. Philippians 2, 9 to 11. Beloved, I'm just laying the ground block before we go straight into prayers. Just bear with me. Can I have your permission to spend extra 15, 20 minutes tonight. It's a special day. Bear with us. We know it's supposed to be a one-hour prayer, but today is a special day. Let's have, because we're going to do head, a quick head, hands, and leg deliverance at the end. Extra 15, 20 minutes. God bless you. Thank you for giving me the permission as I go ahead, even though I can't hear you, but I know by faith you're giving me the permission. God bless you. Philippians 2, 9 to 11. Where of God I highly exalted him and given him a name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow of things in heaven, of things on the earth, and things under the earth, and that every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. I declare into your life tonight, every obstacle, every problem, every challenge shall bow to the Lordship of Jesus. Every challenge in your life shall bow to the Lordship of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, they shall bow, they shall bow, they shall bow, they shall bow. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Now, whatsoever you pronounce tonight will bring sweet influences upon your destiny, upon your life, upon your family, upon your endeavors. Job 38 and verse 31. 
Job 38 and verse 31. Can thou bind the sweet influences of the plagues or loose the bounds of the Orion? Can you lose the influence of the plagues and lose the bind the influence of the plagues and lose the bounds of the Orion? The answer is yes, we can bind because whatever we bind on earth is bound in heaven. And whatever we say loose on earth is loosed in heaven. Ecclesiastes 11 and verse 3. If the clouds be full of rain, Ecclesiastes 11 and verse 3. If the clouds be full of rain, they empty themselves upon the earth. And if the trees fall toward the south or toward the north, in the place where the tree falleth, there it shall be. I declare upon you that your cloud of blessing that is full of rain, full of the presence of the Lord, shall rain upon you mightily. In the name of Jesus, your cloud shall rain upon you mightily. In the name of Jesus, your cloud of blessing, your cloud of breakthrough, your cloud of advancement, your cl that cloud will rain upon you mightily where you are. In the mighty name of Jesus, it will rain mightily upon you. In the name of Jesus. Now you will lift up your voice where you are and you will say this uh, command after me loud and clear. We are programming into the heavens and the earth and to the four winds. If you remember Ezekiel in the valley of dry bones. He said, God asked him, can these bones live? Ezekiel said, oh Lord, you are the only one that knows. And the Bible says, and the Lord commanded breath from the four winds. And the Bible says, breath and spirit came from the four winds into the dead bones. And they came alive and began to join bone to bone, sinew to sinew. Not, there's no hopeless situation with the Lord. There is no hopeless situation. You may think that the situation where you are right now seems hopeless because of some new laws and whatever the government, uh, you, know, you know, that they're putting in place and saying that they're no longer give, issuing people papers and giving people this. People are saying it is not possible. Beloved, it is possible. Be, 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 with men, it may not be possible, but not with God. For with God, all things are possible. There is no hopeless situation. If breath and spirit can come into dead bones, bones that have been, you know, bones that have been completely dry, the, they were called dry bones, but they came alive by the breath of the Almighty God from the four winds. I pray for concerning you, concerning your family members. Every death situation in your life shall come alive tonight in the name of Jesus. Shall come alive tonight. Shall come alive tonight in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Now everybody where you are loud and clear, repeat after me. Say in the name of Jesus, this land, the heavens of this land, the waters of this land, the four corners of this land, the gates, the people, living and non-living things, the seat of governments. Say, hear the word of the Lord. Hear the word of the Lord. Favor me and my family. In the name of Jesus, favor me and my family. Yield unto me and my family. In the name of Jesus, say, the land of this nation, the heavens, the waters, the four corners, the wind, the gates, the seat of government. Yield unto me and my family. Yield unto me and my family. In the name of Jesus, do to me and my family. Do us well. Do us well. This land where we are in, do us well. In the name of Jesus, say this land will favor us. This land, you will cooperate with me. In the name of Jesus, this land, you will allow me and my family to do well. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will make room for me and my family. In the name of Jesus, this land, you will make room for me and my family. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will not fight me. You will not fight me. You will not fight me. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will not attack me. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will not be against me. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not war against me. You will not war against me. In the name of Jesus. Say this land. You will not consume me. You will not consume me. You will not consume me. In the name of Jesus. Say this land. Swallow not my blood. This land. Swallow not my blood. Swallow not my blood. Swallow not my blood. In the name of Jesus. Swallow not my blood. In the name of Jesus. Say this land. You will not injure my destiny. You will not enjoy my destiny in the name of Jesus. Say this land, you will not be cruel to me and my family and my work in the name of Jesus. Say this land, you will not frustrate me 
You will not frustrate my family. You will not frustrate my work. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not manipulate me. You will not manipulate my family. You will not manipulate my work. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not abort evil against me. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not disappoint me. You will not disappoint my family. You will not disappoint my work. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not mess up my destiny. You will not mess up my destiny. In the name of Jesus, you will not mess up the destiny of my family members. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not oppress me and my family. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will not limit my potentials. In the name of Jesus, say environmental powers. In this land, you will not limit my potential. You will not cage my potential. You will not limit my potential. You will not cage my potential. In the name of Jesus, say this land. You will favor my potentials. In the name of Jesus, say in this land, gates of the nobles, open upon me, open unto me. In the name of Jesus, say this land, favor me, favor me, favor me. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say this land, you will not suffocate my destiny. You will not suffocate my destiny. You will not suffocate my destiny. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say this land, you will not stop my growth. In the name of Jesus, this land, you will not stop my growth. You will not stop my growth. You will not stop my growth. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will not sanction my development. You will not work against my development. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say a big amen. Say this land, you will not be a battleground for my family. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will not afflict me. You will not afflict my family. You will not afflict my work. In the name of Jesus, this land, you will not speak against me. You will not speak against me. You will not speak against me. In the name of Jesus, beloved, as you are saying it, you will point to the ground. You will, you are, we are addressing the land. We are addressing the land. Wherever you are, you will point your finger to the land. Say, this land, you will not afflict me. You will not afflict my family. In the name of Jesus, you will not afflict my family. In the name of Jesus, this land, you will not oppose my rising. You will not oppose my rising. You will not oppose my rising. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say this land, you will not choke my enlargement. You will not choke my enlargement. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say this land, you will not waste my life. You will not waste my efforts. You will not waste my life. You will not waste my efforts. In the name of Jesus, say this land, you will cooperate with the plan of God for my life and my destiny. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say this land, you will not sponsor difficulties against me and my family. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say a big amen. Say a bigger amen. Say in this land, in the name of Jesus, my family and I, we will flourish like the palm tree. We will grow like the cedar in Lebanon. In the name of Jesus, say this land. God will make a way for me. God will make a way for me and for my family. In the name of Jesus, in this land, God will make room for me. Room for enlargement. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say in this land, God will give me space to flourish. God will give my talent space to flourish. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say my family and I, we shall be established in this land. Say my family and I, we shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus, say amen. The Lord said we should repeat that statement seven odd times. This land. What do we say? This land. We will be, me and my family will be established in this land seven odd times. We will say seven odd times, one to go. In the name of Jesus, this, in this land, me and my family shall be established in the name of Jesus. Me and my family 
shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Me and my family shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Me and my family shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Me and my family shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Me and my family shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say, shall be established in this land. In the name of Jesus. Say, the heaven of this nation will open upon me and my family. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say, the dew of favor in this nation will fall upon me and my family. In the name of Jesus. Say, the government of this nation will favor me. In the name of Jesus. The government of this nation will favor me. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Before we continue, let me pray this one prayer and I want a resounding amen. Remember the daughters of Zelophehad. There was a law that said female children could not inherit property in Israel. They challenged the law and the law was changed on their behalf. I pray for you and I want a resounding amen. Any law in the land that is contrary to your establishment, any law of the land that is contrary to your moving forward, any law of the land that is inhibiting your enlargement and settlement, let that law be changed for you in the name of Jesus. Let that law be changed. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say after me. Say the door of blessings in this nation shall open unto me and my family in the name of Jesus. Say the four corners of this nation will favor me in the name of Jesus. The four corners of this nation will favor me in the name of Jesus. The four corners of this nation will favor me in the name of Jesus. Say prosperity of this nation will favor me, will befriend me, befriend my destiny. Befriend my family. In the name of Jesus, we'll say it again. The prosperity of this nation will befriend me, befriend my destiny, befriend my family. In the name of Jesus, say doors of helpers, doors of helps and helpers in this nation, in this nation, shall open unto me. In the name of Jesus, shall open unto me. In the name of Jesus, say according to Isaiah 13, and verse 2, gates of the nobles in this land shall open unto me and my family in the name of Jesus. Gates of the nobles shall open unto me and my family in the name of Jesus. Say, let the sweet influences in the heavenlies pour upon my destiny, pour upon my family in the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say a bigger amen. Say a bigger amen. 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 Beloved, where you are, just in one second, I want you to ask the Lord. Say, Lord, oh Lord, my Father, have mercy upon my have mercy upon my life. Forgive my sin. Forgive my iniquity. Anything that can hinder my prayer tonight, anything that can hinder my lifting up tonight, oh Lord, forgive me. In the name of Jesus, have mercy upon me. Say, oh Lord, have mercy upon me. Oh Lord, have mercy upon me. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I pray for you and I pray for myself. I want a resounding amen as I go into these proclamations and declarations. The Lord will hear your amen in the name of Jesus. Any power from your foundation quenching your manifestation, saying that you will not settle down in this land, let that power be arrested and disgraced in the name of Jesus. Let that power be arrested. Let that power be disgraced in the name of Jesus. Any power from your foundation causing adverse situation for your glory in this land. Any power from your father's house, any power from your mother's house, saying that you will not settle down in this land, blocking your advancement, blocking, you know, blocking your blocking the expression of your talents and your gifts in this land. Let that power be arrested. 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 In the name of Jesus, can I have a bigger amen? Can I have a bigger amen? Can I have a bigger amen? Say, sudden problems are rising from your foundation, militating against you. 
Let that problem be terminated in the name of Jesus. Let that problem be terminated in the name of Jesus. Let that problem be terminated in the name of Jesus. Say a bigger amen. amen. I pray for you that if there's any evil utterance attacking your destiny as a result of the evils done by your ancestors, as a result of any sin from your lineage, any ancestral iniquity from your father's house or your mother's house, especially those of you from royal families or from ruling houses in your village, I pray any utterance attacking your destiny, attacking your establishment in the land where you are, as a result of the evil done by your ancestors, let that utterance be cancelled by the blood of Jesus Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let that utterance be cancelled by the blood of Jesus Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let that utterance be cancelled by the blood of Jesus Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray for you and I pray for myself. Every foundational inheritance, any foundational inheritance from either parents attacking your glory, let that inheritance come out from your hiding place Amen. in the name of Jesus. Let your inheritance come out from your hiding place in the name of Jesus. Say a big amen. amen. Say any, any familiar spirit. Any I prophesy to your life that any familiar spirit and supervising demon in charge of your affairs, let that demon separate from you amen. now. Separate from you amen. now. Separate from you now. Amen. Separate from you now. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray for you and I pray for myself. Any anti-breakthrough design against you from your roots. You know what a design is? Any design that has been done, that it is not possible, according to this, our design, it is not possible for brother or sister X, Y, Z to move this way or to be established this way or to plant here and reap here. Any anti-breakthrough design from your roots, working against your establishment in this land, let that design scatter. Let that design scatter. Let that design scatter. Let that design be a no. In the name of Jesus, let that design be a no. In the name of Jesus, let that design burn to ashes. In the name of Jesus, let that design burn to ashes. In the name of Jesus, I pray that the Lord will uproot every evil tree from your foundation that is growing against your destiny. Any evil tree from your foundation, from your father's house, that ancient tree in the village, in the market square, growing against your destiny and against your advancement. Let that tree perish by fire Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let the sword of God, the sword of fire, cut off that tree, cut down that tree, cut down that tree in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Matthew 15, 13, any tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and cast to the fire. Let that tree be cut down. 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 Be cut down. In the name of Jesus. Any power from your foundation, drawing energy from the sun, the moon, and the stars to work against your destiny, work against your establishment. Let that power be arrested. Let that power perish. Let that power be arrested. Let that power perish. In the name of Jesus. Any foundational power using the earth the water and the air, we call them triangular powers. The, the, the water, the, the, the earth, and the air against you. Let that power be arrested by fire. Let that power be arrested by fire. Let that power be arrested by fire. In the name of Jesus. Any ongoing witchcraft battle from your foundation, let that battle scatter. Let that battle scatter. Let that battle scatter. In the name of Jesus. Now you will say this with your own mouth loud and clear. Say, I withdraw. I withdraw all my benefits from my foundational oppressors. In the name of Jesus, I withdraw them. All my benefits in the hands of foundational oppressors, I withdraw you. I withdraw you. I withdraw you. Beloved, withdraw it. Withdraw it. Withdraw it. Lift up your voice where you are right now and pray that prayer. I withdraw all my benefits from foundational oppressors. In the name of Jesus, I withdraw all my benefits from foundational oppressors. In the name of Jesus, I withdraw all my benefits. I withdraw all my benefits. In the name of Jesus, say amen. amen. Say a bigger amen. amen. Every foundational gadget of frustration against your life, let them scatter by fire in the name of Jesus. Let them scatter by fire in the name of Jesus. Any foundational battle from your father's house, from your mother's house, from your in-law's house, your land of nativity or your land of birth, inimical to your establishment in this land, let that battle scatter. Let that battle scatter in the name of Jesus. Say a bigger amen. Say a bigger amen. Isaiah 42 and verse 13. 
Isaiah 42 and verse 13. The Lord shall go forth as a mighty man. He shall stir up jealousy like a man of war. He shall cry, yea, he shall roar. He shall prevail against all your enemies. In the name of Jesus, I read it again. Isaiah 42 and verse 13. The Lord shall go forth as a mighty man. He shall stir up jealousy like a man of war. He shall cry, yea, he shall roar. He shall prevail against all your enemies. In the name of Jesus, I stand on the authority of that word and I make the following declarations that any witchcraft power from your land of nativity, any witchcraft power from your foundation working against your destiny, every witchcraft power planning to destroy your ladder of destiny, let that power be arrested, let that power perish, let that power be arrested, let that power perish, let that power be arrested, let that power perish, that power perish. in the name of Jesus. If there's any limitation or embargo placed upon your life by witchcraft powers, in the name of Jesus, let that embargo be lifted. In the name of Jesus, let that embargo be lifted. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Psalm 124 and verse 17. Psalm 124 and verse 17. It says, Our soul is escaped as a bird out of the snare of the fowler. The snare is broken. And we are escaped. The snare is broken. Verse 7, verse 7. 1, 2, 4, verse 7. Our soul is escaped like a bird out of the snare of the fowlers. The snare is broken and we have escaped. Say after me. Say, I jump out. I jump out. Out of every cage. The enemy has kept me. Say, I jump out. 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 In the name of Jesus. Say, the snare is broken. I have escaped. The snare is broken. I have, I have escaped. The snare is broken. The snare is broken. The snare is broken. I have escaped. In the name of Jesus. The snare is broken. I have escaped. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. I pray for you that any witchcraft installation against your destiny, right from your childhood to now, let that witchcraft installation scatter by fire. In the name of Jesus. Scatter by fire. In the name of Jesus. Scatter by fire. In the name of Jesus. If there's any witchcraft monitoring gadget, whether it's a mirror, whether it's a pot, whatever it is that is being used to monitor your progress where you are, they, they, there are witchcraft installations that are stronger than Facebook and Instagram. Anywhere you are, they are watching you, they are seeing you. I, I will share, I shared this uh, testimony before, or this story before. A brother that went to Germany, he couldn't settle down in Germany until he was deported back to Nigeria. And his older sister said, she brought out a mirror from her bedroom and she told him that you left without telling me. So I followed you. She brought out the, you know, the mirror that she was using to, you know, to monitor him. She told him how he worked in Germany. The day he fell down in a shopping mall and was taken to the hospital, she told him the name of the hospital. This woman was in Lagos. This man was in Germany. Until he was deported back home, he came for deliverance. God helped him. This lady... Uh, recounted, you know, she confessed, she apologized, and she destroyed the mirror. This brother today is doing well. You will do well in the name of Jesus. You will do well in the name of Jesus. You will do well in the name of Jesus. Any witchcraft monitoring gadget being used to monitor you where you are, to monitor your progress, to cancel your letters, to cancel your documents, let that witchcraft gadget bomb by fire, bomb by fire, bomb by fire. Bomb by fire, bomb by fire, in the name of Jesus, say amen. Any witchcraft legislation fashioned against your advancement, let that legislation be abolished, let it be cancelled, let it be abolished, let it be cancelled by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Let it be abolished, let it be cancelled by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, if there's any witchcraft death sentence passed against your destiny, let that death sentence be annulled, be revoked, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any witchcraft arrow fired into your spirit, any witchcraft arrow the enemy has fired against you, into your spirit, that is militating against you, that has scattered what you have gathered in the land where you are. Let that arrow jump out and backfire. Let that arrow jump out and backfire. Let that arrow jump out and backfire. In the name of Jesus. Let that arrow jump out and backfire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft weapon fashioned against you, for it is written, no weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. Everything that rises up against you in judgment, thou shalt condemn. 
any witchcraft weapon of war fashioned against you, fashioned against your family, fashioned against your work, fashioned against your establishment, fashioned against this ministry, let that weapon of war bomb to ashes, bomb by fire, 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 in the name of Jesus. Any witchcraft organ in your body, any witchcraft organ in your body that's been used to remote you, to remote control you, unknown to you, let that instrument bomb by fire in the name of Jesus. Let it bomb by fire in the name of Jesus. Let it bomb by fire in the name of Jesus. If any curse has been issued against you by, by agents of domestic wickedness, because of your glory. They've gone to research your glory and they see that you have a big glory. Your star is shining and they want to dim your light. They want to quench your fire. If any curse has ever been issued against you by agents of domestic wickedness, Bible says in Proverbs 26 and verse 2, Proverbs 26 and verse 2, says, a curse costless shall not come. A curse costless shall not come. I pray for you. Any curse ever issued against you that is blocking your path, making things so difficult and impossible for you, let that curse be reversed. Let that curse be reversed. Let that curse be reversed. In the name of Jesus. Let that curse be reversed. In the name of Jesus. I take authority over any curse of financial destruction, any curse of marital destruction, any curse of physical and spiritual destruction operating in your life and destiny. I take authority over it and I cancel it by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Let that curse be cancelled. 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 Let that curse be cancelled in the name of Jesus. I command any curse or all curses ever issued against you I command them broken in the name of Jesus. Let them be broken in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The roots of your life, let it be pushed by the blood of Jesus. Let the blood of Jesus go to your foundation right now and purge your roots. Purge your roots in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If there's any curse ever issued against you that is making you sick where you are, so much so that you, you, know, you are able to walk to your fullest. You are able, you know, you are unable to express yourself to your fullest. I pray, let that curse be cancelled. Let it be revoked in the name of Jesus. Let it be cancelled. Let it be revoked in the mighty name of Jesus. Let it be cancelled. Let it be revoked in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Isaiah 28 and verse 18. Isaiah 28 and verse 18. Studio, you need to help me. Let's be fast, please. We don't have much time. Isaiah 28 and verse 18. Isaiah 28 and verse 18 says, And your covenant with death shall be disannulled, and your agreement with hell shall not stand. When the overflowing court shall pass through, then ye shall be trodden down by it. Your covenant with hell, your covenant with death shall be disannulled, and your agreement with hell shall not stand. I pray for you, that person. If there's any covenant operating from your foundation, that is inimical to your establishment in this land. Let that covenant be broken by fire. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus break it. Let the blood of Jesus break it. In the name of Jesus, let that covenant be broken by the superior covenant in the blood of Jesus. Let that covenant be broken by the superior covenant in the blood of Jesus. Let that covenant be broken. Let that covenant be broken. Let that covenant be broken. In the name of Jesus, let that covenant be broken. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now, I pray that any power backing up satanic covenant in your family, let that power, let that power be arrested. Let that power be eliminated. In the name of Jesus, every power from your foundation, from your father's house, from your mother's house, that has vowed that you will not be established in this land. Let that covenant and the power backing that covenant be annulled in the name of Amen. Jesus. Let them be annulled in the name of Jesus. Be annulled in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If there's any hidden secret covenant assigned to destroy you suddenly in this land where you are, do that covenant you have been discovered and you, I command you to break by fire in the name of Jesus. Break by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. Covenant in the blood of Jesus. 
thou covenant in the blood of Jesus. Swallow any other covenant operating in the lives of your children, opposing their establishment in the name of Jesus. Every covenant opposing our doing well in this land. Let the superior power in the covenant of the blood of Jesus swallow that covenant. Swallow that covenant. Amen. Swallow that covenant. Amen. Swallow that covenant. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. By the blood of Jesus, any evil covenant affecting your destiny in this land, let that covenant break. Let it 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 break. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any covenant of poverty, any covenant of ancestral poverty affecting you in this land. That's why you are unable to get good jobs, unable to get any opportunity. When doors open, they shut against you before you are able to walk through. Any covenant of ancestral poverty working against you, let that covenant break in the name of Jesus. Let that covenant break in the name of Jesus. Let that covenant break in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say a big amen. Studio, can I have Judges 6, 25 and 26? Judges 6, 25 and 26. We're going to pray against evil altars blocking our establishment in this land. And it came to pass, Judges chapter 6, 25 and 26. Thank you, studio. And it came to pass the same night that the Lord said unto him, Take thy father's young bullock, even the second bullock of seven years old, and throw down the altar of Baal that thy father has, and cut down the groove that is by it, and build an altar unto the Lord your God upon the top of this rock in the ordered place, and take the second bullock and offer a burnt sacrifice with the wood of the groove which you have cut down. Gideon had to cut down the altar of his father's house and build a new altar unto the Lord before he could advance and move forward. I've come as a privileged servant of God tonight to declare into your life that every altar from your father's house blocking your destiny, not causing you to advance. Let that altar scatter. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus, every idol that our fathers worshipped in time past that is causing problems for us now, and preparing to fight our children later. I pray, let that altar scatter. Let that altar scatter. Let that altar scatter. Let that altar scatter. In the name of Jesus. Let that altar scatter. In the name of Jesus. Every evil altar sponsoring shame and disgrace against you. Every evil altar sponsoring and blocking your advancement in this land. By the authority in the blood of Jesus, I challenge that altar. I challenge that altar. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus, Amen. let that altar be destroyed. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any token being used on that altar against you, let that token catch fire. Let it catch fire. Let it catch fire. Let it catch fire. Let it catch fire. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any sacrifice made on any evil altar against you. Blocking your chances of making it in this land. Let that sacrifice burn to ashes. Let it burn to ashes. Let it burn to ashes. Let it burn to ashes. In the name of Jesus. Let it burn to ashes. In the name of Jesus. Any evil covenant from your father's house or from your environment, known or unknown to you, working against your destiny, let that altar scatter. Let that altar scatter. In the name of Jesus. Say, I withdraw my name. Lift up your voice and say this prayer after me. I withdraw my name from any evil altar in my environment, in my father's house, in my mother's house, in my in-laws' house. I withdraw my name. I withdraw my name. I withdraw my picture from any evil altar representing me. In the name of Jesus, I will draw my name. 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 In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say, I will draw my glory. I will draw my virtues from any evil altar where my name has been kept. In the name of Jesus, I will draw my virtues. I will draw my glory. I will draw my glory. I will draw my glory. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say a bigger amen. I pray for you that let the hammer of God smash to pieces. Any any altar erected to fight your destiny. Let the hammer of God smash them to pieces. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command you where you are right now. In your even as you sleep, you will vomit anything that you have ever swallowed, whether in the dream. 
from any altar, anything that was given to you to eat in the dream, you will vomit it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Matthew, Matthew 3 10 says, Every pound with my heavenly father has not punished, shall be rooted up. You will for anything that is in you planted in, 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 into your body esoterically, whether in the dream or in the physical. Let that thing be uprooted now in the name of Jesus. You will vomit them even in the dream. They will come out of you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Anything, if there's anything on any altar, anything that belongs to you, whether it's your hair, your, uh, your cloth, your material, anything that belongs to you, representing you on any satanic altar, anywhere all over the world, whether it's a prayer mountain or anything, whatever is representing you and your family on any evil altar, let the fire of God consume it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Let the fire of God consume it. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Any evil load that has been placed on your head in the dream that you are carrying about that is causing you depression, causing you mighty depression, causing you illnesses and sicknesses. Let that load, let the owners of people who carry their load, carry their load, carry their load, carry their load. in the name of Jesus. Let me not sing this song. Carry your load, though, carry your load, carry your load, though, carry your load. Owners of people load, carry your load. Owners of people load, carry your load. Carry your load, don't carry your load. Carry your load, don't carry your load. On a some people don't carry your load. On a some people don't carry your load. Carry your load, 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 carry your load. Say bigger amen. Any evil load on your head, on your place on your destiny by evil powers from your father's house, your mother's house, or from your environment. Let that roll burn to ashes, burn to ashes, burn to ashes, burn to ashes, burn to ashes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say a bigger amen. Say a bigger amen. Galatians 6.17. Galatians 6.17. Henceforth, let no man trouble me, for I bear in my body the mass of the Lord Jesus. I bear in my body the marks of the Lord Jesus. I want to pray a prayer for one person that will say a, you know, a desperate amen, a faith, a faith amen. I want to pray that any mark of shame, any mark of reproach affecting you where you are, affecting your destiny where you are in that very land, let that mark be wiped off by the blood of Jesus. Let that mark be wiped off by the Lord of Jesus, hey, let that mark disappear. Hey, let that mark disappear. Hey, let that mark disappear. Hey, in the name of hey, Jesus, hey, every mark of hatred, every mark of lack of helps and helpers placed upon your life, let the blood of Jesus wipe it off. 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 In the name of Jesus, every mark of do not help this person. That's why everywhere you go, nobody wants to help you. Ordinarily, you should get help in, you know, Concerning your documents, nobody wants to help. Even those that can help don't want to help. Why? There's a mark of do not help this person. I pray for you. Every mark of hatred that has been placed on your forehead, placed on your chest, placed on your head, let that mark be erased. Let that mark disappear by the blood of Jesus. Amen. Let that mark disappear in the name of Jesus. Every mark of setback, every mark of demotion, every satanic mark, every mark of, you know, every, every mark of retardation, every mark of back to square one, ever placed on you, working against your destiny, limiting your establishment in the land where you are. Let that mark disappear by Amen. fire, disappear by Amen. fire, disappear by fire, Amen. disappear by fire, Amen. disappear by fire, Amen. disappear by fire, disappear by fire. Disappear by fire. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every mark of limitation ever placed upon your life, limiting your advancement, limiting your breakthrough, let that mark disappear by fire, Amen. disappear by Amen. fire, disappear by Amen. fire. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Matthew 27 and verse 19. Matthew 27 and verse 19. Studio, help me, help me, be fast, please. Matthew 27 and verse 19. When he, he was set down on the judgment seat, his wife sent unto him, saying, Have thou nothing to do with this just man? For I have suffered many things this day in a dream because of him. I have suffered many things this day in a dream because of him. I pray for you and I wholly pray for myself. Everything you have suffered in your dream, hindering your settlement in this land, every terrorizing power that has encountered you in the dream, 
because of your advancement, because of your glory, let that dream be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let that dream be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Let that dream be cancelled in the name Amen. of Jesus. Let that dream be cancelled in the name of Amen. Jesus. Every negative reoccurring dream, each time you want to do something new in this land, each time you want to get your documents, each time you want to get a new job, each time you want to start a new business in this land, that dream always reoccurs. And once you have that dream, nothing happens again. I pray for you. Every negative reoccurring dream, Hindering your establishment in this land. Let that dream be cancelled. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Say a big amen. Now, everybody, put your oil by your mouth. Put your oil by your mouth. If you have oil with you, if you don't have oil, bring out water. Don't worry. Later, you can get a bottle of oil. And then you will repray, repray these prayers. Later, we are live on YouTube, so this this message will still remain on YouTube. It will still remain on uh, Facebook. You can always go back and replay these prayers. Prayers continue. You don't pray once and stop. You continue praying these prayers, and the Lord will give you testimonies in the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus. Now, put your oil by your mouth. Say after me. Say, fire of God. Fire of God. Fire of God. Flow into my oil. Fire of God. Flow into my oil. Fire of God. Flow into my oil. In the name of Jesus. Fire of God. Flow into my oil. In the name of Jesus. Fire of God. Flow into my oil. In the name of Jesus. Say blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. Flow into my oil. Blood of Jesus. Flow into my oil. Blood of Jesus. Flow into my oil. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say a big amen. Psalm 3 verse 3. You can put down your oil. Put down your oil now. Psalm 3 verse 3 says, But thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and the lifter up of my head. My glory and the lifter up of my head. I want to pray a simple prayer for you. That Listen first. Your head is a symbol of your destiny. So anything done against your head is done against your destiny. I pray for you. Any attack on your head, that any past attack, present attacks, or present or ongoing attacks, or future attacks against your head, against your destiny. Let those attacks be aborted. Let them 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 be aborted. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Your head must attract goodness. In the name of Jesus, your head must attract goodness. In the name of Jesus. Now, everybody, just put your finger into that oil. There's a bottle of oil in my office. Go and go take that one. For my wife. Sure. Dip your finger in that oil. Put a mark on your forehead. Ladies, I didn't say anoint your attachment to. Don't anoint your weave, uh, your, your, your wig. Put the, let that oil touch your, your skin. Just a little oil. Put the mark of the cross on your forehead. And you say after me. Say my head. My head. Attract goodness. Attract goodness. My head. My Attach goodness, my head be connected to testimonies in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, my head be yoked with unusual favor in the name of Jesus. Say, My head be yoked, be connected to unusual favor in this land in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, my head, my head, my head be anointed for goodness, be anointed for success. In the name of Jesus, say my head, be elevated, be, al be elevated to the top. In the name of Jesus, say my head, my head, you must be in the midst of nobles and achievers. In the name of Jesus, say my head, you will be found amongst achievers. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, say my head, attract mercy, attract grace, attract helps. And help us in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, you are blessed in the name of Jesus. Say, Amen. Say, My head, carry anointing, carry favor, carry power in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, you will not be bewitched. My head, you will not be bewitched in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, my destiny, you will not be manipulated in the name of Jesus. Say, My head, you will do well. You will do well. 
Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. amen. Say my head. Receive new ideas. Say my mind. My mind. Be settled. My mind. Think straight. In the name of Jesus. My mind. Receive new ideas. Fresh ideas. Fresh enablement. In the name of Jesus. Say my head. You will not suffer anymore. In the name of Jesus. Say any wrong mark on my head. Any wrong mark on my on my brain. That you that mark disappear now. Disappear now. Disappear now. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say my head. My head. Carry grace. Carry grace. Carry grace. Carry grace. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say the head of my children. Carry favor. You will do well. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. In the name of Jesus. Say any mind attacks against my mind. Do those attacks. Stop now. Stop now. Stop now. Be terminated. Be terminated. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say a bigger amen. Say a bigger amen. Now in two seconds, begin to bless your head. With your own mouth, bless your head. Say my head. My head carry favor. My head carry favor. My head begin think straight. Think straight in the name of Jesus. My head, bless your head. Use your own mouth. Say what you want upon your destiny. Use your mouth to bless your head. Remember, as you speak in his ears, so will he do unto you in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Say, my head, my head. reject attacks. Reject attacks. My, head. my head, reject evil summoning. In the name of Jesus, name say of my, Jesus. Head. my head, reject poverty, reject, reject curses, reject, curses. reject failure. Reject in the failure. name of Jesus, the name for of our Jesus. time, say, just say amen to this proclamation. I command from today, your head, the head of your children, the head of your family, the head of your home, the head of your work, your business. From today, reject stagnation. In the name of Jesus, amen. reject delay. Amen. In the name of Jesus, amen. reject disturbances. In the name of Jesus, amen. reject retardation. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. reject servitude. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. reject inadequacies. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. reject strange embargoes. Amen. In the name of Amen. Jesus, let your head reject strange embargoes. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. say a bigger Amen. Amen. Say a bigger Amen. 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 I pray for you that any cobweb on your head, any cobweb attack ongoing on your head, let the fire of God destroy them. Let the fire of God destroy them. Let the fire of God destroy them. In the name of Jesus. I pray for you that, beloved, say amen to this. If you have not said amen since morning, to this one, say amen. Any power demanding for your head, any power from the kingdom of darkness demanding for your head, let that power be wasted. In the name of Jesus. Let that power be wasted. 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 In the name of Jesus. If you don't understand, let me explain. John the Baptist was locked up in prison. Remember, he was, apart from his spiritual assignment, he was a blood relation with Jesus. They were cousins. He was locked up in prison. Jesus did not attend to him. At the end of the day, Herod was having a party. And Herodias, the daughter of Herodias, demanded for the head of John the Baptist. And, John, uh, you know, and Herod said he should be brought. They went to the prison cell, took him, beheaded him, placed his head on a charger. You know what the charger is? Those of you that go to parties, don't form for me. Or don't form now. You know what charger is. All you party people, you know what it is. They placed his head on a charger and brought him to the party. They used his head for what you call asu. Where I come from. They, they, why? Somebody demanded for his head. That was what happened. That's why I'm praying this prayer for you. I pray for myself. Any power demanding for your head, spiritually or physically, remember, everything that has to do with you has a head. Your work has a head. Your business has a head. Your marriage has a head. The destiny of your children, they all have their heads. So I pray this prayer. Any power demanding for your head, spiritually or physically. Let that power be wasted. 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 In the name of Jesus. Say a bigger amen. Amen. Say a bigger amen. Now, take a little oil. You will anoint your two hands. Deuteronomy 28 and verse 12. 
Deuteronomy 28 and verse 12 says, The Lord shall open unto thee his good treasure, the heaven to give the rain in thy land in season, and to bless all the work of thy hand. And thou shalt let unto many nations, and thou shalt not borrow. The Lord will bless the work of your hands. You shall lend unto nations, and you will not borrow. I pray for you, I pray for everyone connected to you, that your hands will not be amputated. In the name of Jesus, anoint your hands, and beloved, put your two hands in front of you like this. We're going to make some pronouncements into our hands. We're going to make some pronouncements into our hands. In the name of Jesus. Because your hand is a symbol of your prosperity. Your hand is a symbol of your skills. Your hand is a symbol of blessing. Your hand is a symbol of actions. Your hand is a symbol of your expression. God has ordained your hands for exploits. And your hands will do exploits in the name of Jesus. Beloved, put your hand in front of you and say a big amen. Don't let your amen go down. A closed mouth is a closed destiny. Don't keep quiet, I beg you. I pray for you. Your hands will possess their possession in the name of Jesus. Your hand will receive good things from God and from man. In the name of Jesus. Whatever you lay your hands upon to do will prosper. In the name of Jesus. You will take delivery of your own portion. In this land, you will take delivery of your own portion. In the name of Jesus. Every miracle assigned to you, take possession of it. In the name of Jesus. You will, you will receive miracles, receive signs, receive wonders. In the name of Jesus. With your hands, you will do extraordinary exploits. In the name of Jesus. Let your hand receive the power for wealth creation in the name of Jesus. Let your hands, I anoint your hands by faith wherever you are for multiple streams of income in the name of Jesus. Receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it in the name of Jesus. With your hands, begin to build your estates in the name of Jesus. Begin to design new things in the name of Jesus. Begin to operate new machines in the name of Jesus. Begin to fabricate products in the name of Jesus. Let you with your hands you will worship God in the name of Jesus. With your hands you will praise the Lord. You will shout hallelujah in the name of Jesus. With your hands you will show forth the praise of the Lord God Almighty in the name of Jesus. All those of you trusting God for the foot of the womb in this land, with your hands you will carry your babies Amen. in the name of Amen. Jesus. With your hands you will carry your babies Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. With your hands you will express your talents Amen. and your gifts. In the name of Jesus, your hands will not be amputated, your hands will not be sick. In the name of Jesus, your hands will not be bewitched. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, say with your mouth now in two seconds, speak to your hands, bless your hands. My hands are blessed, my hands are blessed. In the blessings of the Lord, with the blessings of the Lord, my hands are blessed, my hands are blessed. With the blessings of the Lord, with your blessings of the Lord. Anyone I touch surely must be blessed. Anything I do surely must be blessed. My hands are filled with the blessings of the Lord. With the blessings of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Anything that has been leaking in your hands, I want a resounding amen to this. If your hand has been leaking, let the blood of Jesus heal your hands now. In the name of Jesus, let the fire of God for healing flow into your hands. Flow into your hands. Flow into your hands. Flow into your hands. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If you have never started and completed anything before, since the day you were born, everything you start, you don't complete. It means your hands are leaking. I pray. Let the healing power of God flow into your hands. In the name of Jesus, let every arrow of bewitchment jump out and backfire. In the name of Jesus, your heart will do well. In the name of Jesus, so shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name. Now, say, say this loud and clear. I'm rushing for time's sake. Say, I charge my hands with the fire of God. I charge my hands with Holy Ghost fire. I charge my hands with Holy Ghost fire. I charge my hands with Holy Ghost fire. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say, I soak my hands in the blood of Jesus. I soak my hands in the blood of Jesus. I soak my hands in the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say amen. Say pollution. Disappear from my hands. In the name of Jesus, say pollution. Disappear from my hands. In the name of Jesus, say arthritis. As I clap my hands, disappear. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Say a bigger amen. Now, the same way, take a bit of that oil. Anoint your two feet. Anoint your two feet. Zechariah 10, 12. Zechariah 10 and verse 12. 
Zechariah 10 verse 12 says, And I will strengthen them in the Lord, and they shall walk up and down in my name. I will strengthen them in the Lord, and they shall walk up and down in my name. They shall walk up and down in my name, says the Lord. I will strengthen them in the Lord, and they shall walk up and down in my name. Beloved, your leg is a symbol of your progress. Your leg is a symbol of your speed. Anything done against your leg is to reduce your speed or stop you from moving altogether. So any challenge against or any attack against your leg must be taken very seriously. Now you will say to your leg, say my leg. My leg. My leg. leg. Walk into victory. Walk into into celebration. Walk Walk upon your high places. In the name of Jesus. Say my legs. My legs. My legs. legs. Walk with the right company and association. association. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Say my legs. legs. You will conquer the land. You will subdue the land. You will post possess territories in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say my legs. You will trample. You will walk over serpents and scorpions. In the name of Jesus. Say amen. Say my legs. You will get speed. In the name of Jesus. The Lord, as you are saying, please move around. Move your legs. Move your legs. Say my legs. You will walk upon your high places. Walk upon your high places. My legs. Walk upon your high places. In the name of Jesus. Say my legs. Receive speed. My legs. Receive speed. In this land, my legs receive speed. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say my legs receive grace. Receive mercy. Receive favor. Receive help. In the name of Jesus. Say my legs. You will do well in this land. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We're going to sing this song. I shall get to my promised land. I shall get to my promised land. No matter what the devil may say. I shall get to my promise. In Jesus' name, I shall get to my promise land. I shall get to my promise land. No matter what the devil may say. I shall get to my promise. 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 Amen. Say, I soak my legs. In the blood of Jesus, I soak my legs. In the blood of Jesus, I soak my legs. In the blood of Jesus, say amen. Say, I charge my legs with the fire of the Holy Ghost. I charge my legs with the fire of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, say amen. Say, any spiritual attachment on my legs, disappear now. Disappear now. Disappear now. Disappear now. In the name of Jesus, say, any arrow of failure. Any arrow arrow of backwardness backwardness. fired against my legs, jump out, backfire, jump out, backfire, jump out, out. backfire. In the name of Jesus, say amen. I pray for you and I pray for myself that anything limiting your preventing your legs from moving forward, let that thing disappear in the name of Jesus. Let it disappear in the name of Jesus. Let it disappear in the name of Jesus. From today, let your leg reject slow speed in the name of Jesus. Let your leg reject slow speed. In the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord told Joshua, he said, Whatsoever the soul of your feet shall tread upon shall be yours for an inheritance. The, your legs will possess their possession Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Stay in my legs. My possess, legs. Your possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess in, your possession. Possess in the name of Jesus. Name Say Amen. I declare and I prophesy to your legs that today, from today, your legs will walk upon your high places. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your legs shall be connected Amen. to high places, Amen. to the nobles. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your legs Amen. shall be connected to right ventures. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your legs shall be connected Amen. to right things. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your legs will move in the right direction. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your legs will conquer and subdue the land. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. so shall it be. In the name of God, the Father, Amen. the Son, Amen. and the Holy Ghost. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name, Amen. settled. Amen. Beloved, before I may, I still have, I have 20 pronounced, uh, declarations to make for us before we round up. But before we do that, I want us to give our offering and give the Lord a sacrifice. Psalm 50 verse 5. Studio, let me have that on the screen. Psalm 50 verse 5. Psalm 50 and verse 5. Psalm 50 verse 5 says, Gather my saints together unto me, those that have made a covenant with me by sacrifice. Those that have made a covenant with me by sacrifice. When you pray this kind of prayers, you give the Lord a sacrifice. I have my own sacrifice here in my hand. It's $100. Yours may be more than that. Some of you can do 
more than that. Praise the Lord. Make a sacrifice. A sacrifice is, is costly. It's painful. That's why it's called a sacrifice. It's something that must cost you something. Make a sacrifice with God in the name of Jesus. Make a sacrifice and offer him that sacrifice willingly, joyfully, not grudgingly. In the name of Jesus, some of you can do more than that. Some can do less than that. Whatever it is, let it be between you and God. Give unto the Lord. The details are on the screen. Account details are on the screen. Uh, if you want to do Zelle, whether it's uh, PayPal or Zelle or whatever you want to do, you know, how you want to do the text to give, the details are there on the screen. Please follow the details as we sing this song. At the mention of your name, every knee must bow. At the mention of your name, every tongue confess. At the mention of your name, at the mention of your name. Every knee must bow at the mention of your name. Every tongue confess, you are Lord, you are Lord, you are Lord of Lords, you are King, you are King of Kings. At the mention of your name. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. Amen. Amen and amen. Praise the Lord. I decree into your life and I want amen to the following 20 declarations. I'm going to be very fast for our time's sake. I decree in the name of Jesus that from now, your destiny shall be connected to the goodness in this land in the name of Jesus. Your destiny shall be connected Amen. to the turnaround in this land Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your destiny shall be connected Amen. to the favor in this land Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your destiny shall be connected Amen. to breakthrough in this land Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your destiny shall be connected Amen. to new Amen. things in this land Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Your destiny shall be connected Amen. to the help of God in this land. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your destiny shall be connected to the favor of God, to the mercy of God, Amen. to the grace of God, to the greatness of God. In this land, in the name of Jesus, your destiny shall be connected to the lifting of God, Amen. to the surprises of God, to the wealth in this land, Amen. to the riches in this land, to the goodness in this land. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your destiny shall be connected Amen. to the good things in this land, Amen. to the nobles in this land, Amen. to the good news in this land. Amen. In the name of Jesus, your destiny shall be connected to the establishment in this land. In the name of Jesus, your destiny shall be connected to the blessing in this land. In the name of Jesus, your destiny shall be connected to the testimonies in this land. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, beloved, I raise an altar of testimonies, I raise an altar of answered prayers, of testimonies, of good news, of advancement, of everything great in this land. And there's an altar of establishment in this land. You and I shall be established Amen. in the name of God the Father, Amen. the Son, Amen. and the Holy Spirit. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, I have declared. Amen. 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 In Jesus' name, settle. Shall we share the grace together in fellowship? May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives as we dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. I love you with the love of the Lord. I see you tomorrow, O Lord, said to me. We are receiving anointing for good things. Anointing for good things. O Lord.